Hi my friends, today we model this part called the uh, corrugated sheet which is not so difficult but it is interesting, isn't it? The flat pattern is this. You see lines for bending or folding and you see also the zone of the bending here and there is another line here so between these two lines there is a bending also to the left and here we have uh, the bending mid line and the bending is between this and this so let's start we start with the flat pattern for this time you will see sheet metal start sketch XY rectangle from the origin 1000 tab 2 and 50 home oh I didn't show you the drawing this is the drawing we have here the flat pattern and the part in an isometric presentation and along this line is this uh, view along this line the line B is the other view the angle of bending here is 90 degrees and the radius is 220 the other fold or bending has uh, an angle of 180 degrees and a radius of 120 we start with uh, placing this holes in a rectangular pattern so finish the sketch F6 face ok but what is the thickness the thickness can be set it now two millimeters okay I, I uh, didn't place this dimension <laughs> yes it is not I place here a uh, leader text Continue thickness equals two. Okay, now we have also the thickness coming back. We draw a circle with a diameter of thirty two and distances from the sides of 32 as well thirty two good finish sketch cut not hole not extrude cut 
what to cut this and the uh, depth is the thickness okay by default you can select uh, you can place here a dimension or through you see you have here possibility okay now if we take a look here we see that uh, there are 10 verticals of this hole and five horizontals uh, the total is 86 10 or 5 is 50 the other are four lines and nine columns nine multiplied by four is 36 50 with 36 equals uh, 86 the total number of cuts here or holes okay what are the distances 54 for the columns 48 for the rows A rectangular this feature direction one is this the other orientation this is 54 and the number is 10 as you can see the other direction is perpendicular good orientation four times of uh, a distance of 48 rows not four five this pattern will result in a large number of occurrences consider using optimized compute to increase pattern performance you can ignore this but uh, it is useful for the speed of uh, processing so you see we don't have the fifth row but when I select this we have also that fifth row the number exceeds the uh, limit for optimization so we have uh, 50 holes 50 cuts here good we go back to the placing of another circle right here 32 is the diameter distances are on this direction is 56 and the other direction is 59 okay finish sketch cut uh, this okay you see this is the situation let's apply a rectangular for this cut the first direction is this one but the other orientation nine items at a distance of 54 
the other direction is up the number is 4 and the distance is 48 as before okay now we have the 86 holes good what next next we have to draw one line to apply bending or folding and then the other one dimensions here are 60 degrees 20 millimeters let's make the first line as a sketch line from one side to another with the angle of 60 between these two 60 and the distance of 200 finish sketch fold we have a line we select the line and now we take a look of the sense directions yes i want to fold this side not this side and uh, the radius is uh, small here is the bend radius which is two millimeters the thickness of the sheet metal we want to have 90 degrees 90 degrees and a radius of 220 okay 90 is already selected and here we place our value 220 the uh, line was moved here you see and the other is outside it uh, doesn't appear here good the orientation is good we bend up not down you see you can change the direction but we want up okay we wait a little now is uh, optimization uh, used and we have a bend between this line and one from the outside in the middle you see situation very clear yes okay the next is this bending 75 degrees 332 sketch line between the sides dimensions 75 and 332 is here finish sketch now we want to bend in the other direction yes uh, you see here the first is this and now we want to bend this direction with an angle of 180 the maximum possible uh, by using the fold tool and the radius 120 
And let's do this. Fold above this line, down, radius, the angle is 180. If I select 81, uh, we have the red figures there. So I place here 180 and 120. Orientation is good. The angle you see is 180. And we bend this side, not this side. The uh, arrow is to the right. We can change the direction of the arrow to bend this side. But we want the right, not the left. OK. This is the part, my friends. Now I placed, I selected some colors. Inside is orange. One. Two, three, four zones are to be made orange. And how many on the other side? One. I keep pressed the shift key when I select, yes? Also four zones with uh, dark green. Dark green. Nice combination. You can hide the uh, delimitation lines with shaded and you have the genuine part. You can select a stainless steel, for instance, as the material. And let's see if this is the uh, volume. Part 2, right click. I properties physical update it seems to be but you have to verify copy close double click and paste you see the same value Okay, so this is the part you can create the flat pattern this is the flat pattern with all the uh, lines I presented before Okay, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.